Hey, what's up you guys? So I just wanted to say really quickly before we get started in the video that everything I recorded over those past couple of days was from my point of view and my perspective on everything that was happening. Now, like I said many times before in the videos, I my family was one of the families who were very fortunate enough to still have power throughout the whole thing and it didn't get as bad as many other families had. So we were very fortunate in that way. And then I also wanted to let y'all know if there's any like hate comments or anybody making fun of the whole situation or anything like that, you guys, y'all will be um, blocked from my channel because I'm not going to put up with that, you guys. A lot of people lost their lives and it was not a joking situation. So I take that very seriously. And I also wanted to say, you guys, I wanted to give my subscribers on my Instagram a huge thank you, you guys, for checking on us, reaching out and showing us love. Y'all are caring. Y'all are concerned about everything that was going on. So thank y'all so much, you guys for um, reaching out and just uh, making sure that we were okay. That meant a lot because during that whole situation, it was really stressful. It was scary. Like in the beginning, it was it was a little bit fun because you know, ooh, winter, like it was like winter weather, like it was a little fun. But then as like the days kind of got on, it got a lot more stressful and it was just really scary. But anyways, you guys, without further ado, let's go ahead and jump into the video. hey guys good morning so guys in today's video i just wanted to let y'all know um i know a lot of y'all already know that i live here in texas and you guys today is february 14th or 15th i think it's 14th i don't know i need to double check but anyways um anyways guys so we got like a i guess like some sort of little storm kind of came in and it is freezing you guys it is so cold work was canceled school is canceled we're kind of like under like um, like a watch like everyone just needs to be careful like shouldn't be driving unless you absolutely need to and just things like that and it kind of looks like sunny you guys right it looks sunny but I swear guys it is freezing like everything is iced down there's ice on my windows there's ice outside yeah. I live ah. upstairs sorry guys my kids are in the background I live upstairs and um, the stairs are like so frozen you guys so I'm gonna go outside here in a little bit to show you what it looks like Right now, I'm trying to cook and stuff like that with the kids, guys. Oh, and another thing, guys. We don't have any running water. So, I guess it could be a lot worse, you guys. We still have tons of bottles of water, so we're okay with that. Um, but a lot of people in the area that I live in don't have any electricity since last night. And it got pretty cold, guys. It's, it's like down in the 20s or something like that. Um, but yeah, guys. So, thank gosh we have electricity and we're able to stay warm. If not, we have a fireplace and we're just going to start, you know, burning some wood. But we're just kind of waiting for the pipes to unfreeze so that way we can get some running water. So, anyways, guys, I'm going to finish cooking for the kids. And then I'm going to take you outside so we can kind of see how it looks out there. Guys, okay, so before I take you outside to go look at the, like, how cold it is out there. I'm here in my kids' bathroom and let me show you a look. Turning this both ways, nothing's coming out, guys. All right, guys, so what happened is um, last night we actually, let me flip it this way. So last night we actually kept the um, all the faucets kind of like dripping just a little bit so that way they wouldn't freeze. Not all the faucets, but I, it was just our uh, kitchen one. And then this morning I was kind of in a hurry, like trying to help my better half like get ready for work because he had to do it virtual. I was trying to help the kids because we were supposed to do school, but the internet kept going in and out. Um, in the midst of all that i was making coffee and i actually turned the water off guys and then like it only took an hour an hour later the pipes were frozen and there was no more uh fresh water not fresh but no more running water coming out so yeah made a big boo-boo but anyways guys i'm gonna go finish cooking everybody lunch and then we're gonna go back outside and i will show y'all everything okay so guys this is what i was talking about a lot of the ice has melted it is so slippery right there But yeah, guys, like I said, we are not used to um, this type of weather at all. The ice has melted a lot on the grass. But today, um, tomorrow, or tonight, actually, it's supposed to get a lot colder. And tomorrow's supposed to be freezing. So we're kind of in the middle of a, um, like, freeze watch right now. Okay. Whew. God, it is freezing out here, guys. Wait, go. Look, it froze on the leaf, so oh, now yeah. it's like a leaf. It's like a leaf. Ice. <laughs> it froze on the leaf. <sighs> so 
back and that way guys right over here is like a main road and i can see it a lot better on my balcony up there but it's actually not closed off but not a lot of people are driving on it there's always a lot of people driving over here and it has been dead for like the past three days because like i said on friday we got um everybody kind of knew what was going to happen and then um that's when monday came work closed and all that stuff and Oh my gosh guys okay i'm gonna put the camera down for a little bit because my hands are freezing Whew. alrighty guys so we're taking a little stroll around here the apartments it is absolutely cold guys yeah the sun is out but let me just put it this way guys i live about a three hour drive from mexico so i'm pretty close to where it's always hot all the time <laughs> so we are not used to this at all so a lot of us are kind of like freaking out because a lot of our pipes are frozen People don't know how to drive in this weather. Sorry guys, somebody was walking by, but um, everything is like frozen, so. Oh wow, there's icicles over here. Let me show y'all really quickly. I just wanted to give y'all a quick little update real quick. Sorry, my hair looks crazy. Um, so today is, what is today? Today's Wednesday, right? Um, when I recorded the other videos for y'all, it was Monday and then I had Tuesday off. Tuesday's weather was pretty bad, but I didn't have to go anywhere. So I just stayed home and kind of just hunkered down, right? Hold on. So Wednesday, I'm here at work. You guys, we have no heat, okay? It is freezing cold in here and the toilets are all broken so now we don't even have restrooms to go to so a lot of us are like pretty upset and surprisingly some patients are still coming in and i'm just kind of like like what are y'all doing stay home like i don't know but yeah guys i just want to update you really quickly weather is still horrible horrible over here guys horrible there's so many people that don't have power and it's just so worse guys like i just feel so bad for those people Sorry guys, I'm here at work. I'm trying to record this, but anyways, I just wanted to update y'all really quickly on what was happening um, here at work. I'll be home tonight. Thank God I have um, power, so I'm fortunate enough to have power. But yeah, guys, I will just keep updating y'all on how tomorrow is and how this weekend goes because supposedly we're supposed to get another Arctic storm. So I don't know, guys. We'll see what happens. Okay, guys. I am headed to my house to go use the restroom because the restrooms don't work here. I was in such a hurry, guys, that I had to go so bad I forgot my freaking coat. So it is like freezing. Oh my gosh. Guys, when you just think it can't get any worse, it just keeps getting worse and worse. Oh, I'll be back. Alright guys, look how desperate everybody is for gas. There is a line out there, I don't know if you see that little black car. And then look way back here. There is a whole line of people that are desperate for gas. All right, guys, I just got home right now. It is 5.30 and we're out of hot water. Uh, so yeah, um, we have some running water. It's really slow, but no hot water. So I'm literally boiling water in my like little tea kettle and I'm gonna pour it in there because I need to take a shower, guys. I just been with patients all day and kind of running around and stuff and I need to shower. So yeah. Good morning, guys. Whew, it is freezing out here, you guys. I know I look horrible, and oh well, it is what it is, guys. I literally just woke up, brushed my teeth, got dressed real quick, and I'm headed to the store. Oh, it's freezing out here. I need to go um, and get some meat if I can. I'm trying to get there before the store opens, which I'm sure there's going to be a ton of people there. Um, hold on, guys. Let me get in my car real quick. Okay, guys, um, it's so cold. Like I was saying, I'm pretty sure there's going to be a ton of people there, but 
We need groceries, guys. We need some meat. We need lunch meat, something. Um, just cold. We are down to our last pack of like um, pork chops. So I just need to go and get like at least three days worth of meat, which isn't really a lot for us. Um, maybe some chicken if I can. I don't know. But I'm going to take y'all with me because last time I was at HB, it was crazy. But uh, let me just see how much I can film you guys. I'm not sure how much I can because if everybody is in like chaos and trying to like hurry and grab everything, then it might be like a little hard for me to film. But I'm going to try, okay, guys? So I'm going to just let my car warm up and then I'll be back once I get to the store. safe and sound the roads are pretty wet because it's raining um but it, there's no ice so that's a good thing um there's actually a freaking line over there you guys of people just waiting out there oh my gosh and it doesn't open until like another 20 minutes honestly i'm gonna wait you guys i already oh it's opening okay i'll be back oh my god guys it looks dead but look there's nothing in the frozen aisle <laughs> oh there's no salads all the fruit's gone Holy crap, holy crap, hold on. Let me see, okay, that aisle's, oh God, there's no bread, there's hardly any sauce. Look at all this. Oh wow, there's like no meat, you guys. Look, down there's where the meat is. <sighs> okay guys, I gotta put y'all down real quick. like nothing guys there was like really nothing i mean i was lucky enough to get some ham 
um, some sausage, cheese. Like I was, I was lucky enough to get some stuff, but there was really not much to get. There was no fruit at all. They, they were telling us the butchers were like, we don't even know when we're getting our shipments and like we don't know when we're gonna have any meat or any chicken or pork or anything. Luckily, I found some pork ribs for us. It was like one little slab. They had a lot of brisket, but it looked a real fatty. So I didn't get any of that. Plus, my, it, they were huge and I wouldn't, my, I don't even think my oven would be big enough for that. So I knew my mom needed to go to HB2, guys. And I know I've never said this in a video, but my mom watches my grandma. She takes care of her. She has dementia and she's like 96, I want to say. And so she's always home with her all the time and so it's kind of hard sometimes for my mom to go out and go get groceries so my mom normally orders groceries to be delivered at her house because it's a lot easier than just like she doesn't want to leave my grandmother by herself at home and to bring her out in this weather is not okay because she can get sick really easily so when i was there i called my mom and said hey i'm here i can grab some sausage i can you know there's like a few things i can grab for you what do you need so i was able to get her a few things not a lot um like I said, there was like hardly anything and they have no idea when they're getting the shipment in. So, oh, sorry guys. So, yeah, it's like, it's like a madhouse right now, you guys. Uh, everyone's kind of just scrambling to hurry and try to get stuff from the stores. And that's because I was one of the early people there. Like, I was lucky enough to have got there right when it opened, you guys. Y'all saw when I hurried up and ended that video. So, there was people even going after me that, like, there was no milk. There was, there was nothing, you guys, like it's crazy but i don't know i mean i got i got us enough food for a couple of days and we're gonna be okay thank gosh we have electricity still oh sorry guys there's an ambulance coming by thank gosh we still have electricity um as far as running water goes we have a tiny bit of running water like it runs really really slow but we have no hot water so um yeah guys it's just been a really trying time and I'm praying for all the families who don't have electricity because I know they're really suffering right now. And it's not like you can be like, oh, go out and go get food. It, no, guys, there's like no electricity. Like nothing is open. Like no McDonald's, no water burger, no, nothing is open for them to get food. So I don't know. I, I just, I'm praying for them. I really am. I'm praying that this, this will just all be over soon. But anyways, guys, I'm going to head over to my mom's house. I'm going to unload some of the groceries for her. Then I'm going to get home and then make some breakfast for the kids because I know they're hungry. So um, if anything changes or if I do anything throughout the day, which I'm probably not, I'm going to just stay home and hunker down because it's really nasty out here. It's real rainy and yeah, I just don't want to risk being on the road too much. Um, but I'll let y'all know how tomorrow goes when I go into work. Hey guys, I'm here at my mom's. She actually made this little cart right here, guys, for her groceries. So I'm uh, taking it to her now. Damn, it's cold. Hey guys, good morning. So I am about to head into work right now. It is Friday. It's still really, really cold, guys, but the sun is out just a little bit. So it's kind of warming it up. Um, no ice or anything like that, so that's good. Um, it actually looks like it's gonna rain. Looks like some rain clouds are rolling in. Uh, let me show y'all real quick. Yeah, you see that, guys? See how it's like clear blue and then like black over there? So I think some rain clouds might be rolling in this way. So we'll see what happens. I'm gonna get to work, you guys, and then I will uh, start recording when I'm there. Hey, guys, so I'm here in work and we have power and we have heat and the toilets are working so uh today's just a half day in the morning so it should be pretty quick you guys so far the weather looks like it's starting to go back to normal but i'm gonna keep you guys updated hey guys i'm just getting out of work right now and as y'all can see it is nice it is beautiful it is sunny and it is hot <laughs> what we're used to you guys so it feels so much better out here and i feel like this is like the end of everything we were going through hopefully it is fingers crossed um but i just really wanted to thank you guys for watching this video and kind of um seeing how it was through my um my eyes and like my point of view of everything like i said a lot of other places had it so much worse than i did i was just very fortunate enough to still have power um as far as running water went it was a little on and off but we were still very fortunate throughout this whole um i guess like disaster that was going on 
um anyways you guys i'm gonna get ready to head out and head home so if y'all have any questions or want to comment below y'all go ahead and do that you guys and don't forget to give it a like and i'm wishing y'all peace love and happiness you guys and i'll see you on the next video bye